Hi friends, here in this video, I will be explaining the concept of rigid body. Now rigid body, it is that body on which if a force is applied, it will show zero deflection or zero change in dimension. That is the moment if I see an object here, when I am applying a load, it will deform. So if it is deforming, then it is not considered as a rigid body. But the moment when we apply the force on that body, if it is rigid, then it has to show zero deflection. And basically when we talk about rigid bodies, this is an ideal concept that is rigid bodies does not exist in nature. Even if we have the hardest of the materials, they are going to deflect or show at least small amount of or very minute amount of deflection or deformation on the application of force or load. So this is just a theoretical concept and whenever we are dealing in mechanics, we are considering rigid bodies. That is, it is not essential to write everywhere that we are using rigid body, but whatever the examples we are taking, that is of a rigid body. So I will write down the definition here. A rigid body So it does not undergo any change in dimension due to the application of force or load. Next. The rigid bodies does not exist in nature. It means it is just a theoretical concept which is used for solving the problems related to mechanics in which whatever the examples are there uh, or whatever the elements are given, we are considering them as rigid bodies and then we are solving the problems. So in short, I can just summarize that rigid body is that body in which the deflection would be zero on the application of force that is whatever amount of force we apply onto that element it will show zero deflection and in real applications the opposite of rigid body that is an elastic body is used because when we apply the load on an elastic body in that case it is going to deform under the action of load and the moment we remove the load it will regain its original shape and size. So elastic bodies are actual very much visible in the real life applications compared to rigid bodies. At the end, if you all find my videos helpful, you all can like, share, comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.